like tens of thousands of these have been ordered, but my gosh, I know a lot because it sells out like every time it's here. I don't here. even think it is anywhere but here, um, but I have to tell you, I just call this the bacon pin. Okay. So for literally almost two decades now on television, I've told people, sometimes screamed at people, <laughs> don't put bacon in a frying pan. You get hot spots, it curls, and it cooks very unevenly. So half of this slice of bacon is burnt, and half of the slice is raw and rubbery, <laughs> and it's only half crispy. Yeah. Everyone that worked or has worked or is working in a restaurant knows that for restaurant people, we bake our bacon on giant sheet trays, mm -hmm. the size of an industrial oven. Okay. <clears throat> and we bake them on parchment paper, and the bacon ends up sitting in its own fat, but it bakes evenly, it doesn't splatter anywhere, it's easy to dispose of the grease, and it gets super crispy and you never have to turn it. In life, I tell people to put the bacon on the broiler pan, the slotted pan, so all the fat drips away. Bake it at 375 for 15 to 18 minutes, depending on how crispy you like your bacon, uh -huh. and you're done. <clears throat> the problem with that is, though, Jane, most people cannot find or recognize the <laughs> broiler pan <laughs> that came with their range mm -hmm. God knows how many years ago. Um, so I wanted a pan that allowed us to make crispy bacon, and you see it has this insert. The fat drips underneath. You never have to flip the bacon. And this is 15 minute bacon. I'm 18 minute bacon. Okay. I like it almost burnt. Yeah, me too. Um, you can take it as far as you like. You never have to turn it. It never splatters. It won't make a mess on your stove. However, if you like to make onion rings, um, you know, just grocery store onion rings, not deep fat fried, but just reheated in the oven. If you like to make potatoes in the oven, either from scratch or just cooking off store-bought. I've got some in the oven okay. now. This will make them extra crisp. If you make cutlets, like we've got some chicken cutlets over here with a little red sauce and cheese. If you like to make cutlets, eggplant, chicken, mm -hmm. whatever, it keeps the cutlet, the heat circulating around it, it keeps it crispy on both sides. Right. If you like extra crispy cookies, mm -hmm. Bake them right on right. this sucker. Absolutely. Anything you want extra crisp, you use this. If you don't want it extra crisp, you take this out. I use Here's that. the third thing, okay? If you want a soft cookie or a, 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 a genoise, a jelly roll mm -hmm. cake, here's the third thing about this pan. So you can use it with or without the insert, right? It's also deep enough because it has a double lip and these super heavy duty handles and it's super heavy grade. It never bends or twists. You can use this as just a straight up roasting pan. For chickens, look at the giant roast yeah, they prepared here today with the rosemary. A leg of lamb, a whole turkey. You can use this also as a roaster. So this is a three in one system for not a lot of money that does no. a ton of stuff. And it's buy more, save more too. $19 right. for the second one. I you know three. drop the mic, that's drop the pan. Yeah. <laughs> I have three because Rachel was on with David and we were so and you busy kept on pushing the phone it and you kept right, I was on Long Island and I, I didn't I've think done my that order too. went through and I actually ended up buying three so they came to the house and I and thought she was oh, going to give them away I was going to give one to my sister yep. and one to my I'm gonna daughter I'm going to get the french fries you I mean, keep telling my offspring and my sister my best Chrissy guess what they got nothing because I kept all three of them and Rachel's going to love me I think you're going to hit me with the with the mopine again <laughs> I've only made bacon once that's once. what I designed it for Jane <laughs> No, I've only, because we're not a big bacon family, but I use it for veggies Jane. all the time. I know. Unless you're vegetarian, everyone's a bacon family. But how about me having three of them and loving them for no. everything? Of course I'm joking. Lots of people are not bacon yeah. families. My own sister doesn't eat pork. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's it's not a big deal. But it's the, the best point is, if you ever. Like, if you like crispy things, crispy fries, a crispy oven ring, a crispy anything, or you like to keep your eggplant cutlets crispy. Stuff. It's, a, it's just a useful thing. We were just saying we were hungry. This is really good. Okay. Mm. Oh. We introduced this pan oh my a God. year and a half ago. They're like, they're like potato they're chips. so good. It's sold out time and time again. In just a year and a half. Because I don't even know where to tell people to get them other order? than here. I don't know. 100,000 of these because have Because they ordered. don't exist in the country. First of all, I drew it, so it really doesn't exist without my name on it. But. I don't even think we sell it in retail. No. I think it's only here. And you know what I love about it too? Okay, these aren't hot. You know how I have three? This is why. Now this one has chicken wings in it. Hello, that's making me happy. Mm. 
they nest so easily. Boom, boom, boom. And I that, actually keep them in my oven. The greatest cookie pan ever. They never twist. Mm -hmm. If you all, if you, all you use it for is baking, you're gonna love it. They never twist. They don't warp. They don't stain. They don't get those ucky little dots that cheap metal bakeware right, gets. Right. Right. They're fabulous. Maria uses them like a, a machine. Yeah, because that woman can Maria's bake. Maria's like, Maria bakes, my sister bakes like a factory. Yes, it's ridiculous. And they are everything she makes. I mean, I just like, I'm like a puppy. I wait for Christmas. And I'm like, did Maria bring the cookies yet? <laughs> Love David you, asked me earlier, he's like, what kind of cobbler is your favorite? I'm like, whatever my sister is making. <laughs> I don't make cobbler. So here's the thing. Uh, Brian, how many have been ordered? He's our wonderful producer. 1,500 in the show. He just said the words I don't want to hear. Not many of these to go around. I told you. They sell out every time because I can't tell people where to buy them in stores. I know. And the first one you is $22. You keep talking about the onion rings. I will love. Mm. The second one is only $19. So it's buy more, save mm. more. And if you think that, oh, I'll buy one for me and one for my girlfriend or my nope. sister. No. Get two for you and at least one for her because you I use these all the time. They're I amazing. Them. I used all three at Easter because I had asparagus in one. I had oh my God, roast asparagus on so these? Good for so veggies. good. And then I did a little one of uh, a quick little baked chicken and the third, uh, they're going all the time and the cleanup is like this. It's nothing. You wipe it, you look at it and it's clean. Yeah, it's so you wipe clean. it with a paper towel, it's fine. And I just think it's so cool that a hundred thousand people Get it because well because no you can't find this anywhere else. Mm -mm. Period. It's like what? No, it's I can't I can't even say it's my favorite thing because I have so many favorites, but I literally love it. So we're so busy Bless right you. now. Automated order, automated mm -hmm. ordering. QVC.com app on your phone. Now, Rach, we're not going to get a chance to talk about it, but we do <laughs> have available. Oh no, we put it back in your here. Your favorite mini cake pans, the show. are they? Are yeah. they? Okay, good. Okay, so there's the mini cake pans. I bought them the last time we were on when you hit me with a towel because I said you could break the setup. Don't People don't understand. Up. You guys don't know what, what these are. What these are are little layer cakes. Like you can make a double layer or a triple layer cake just like the big size, but they're little. I don't okay. know. We'll show them so later. Now look. Kara on Easter made baby Boston cream.